Yo, 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 it's Marsha here. Another day, another video. And we're just waiting for Philip to come through with his M3 because basically he bought a new exhaust for his car, but he wasn't happy with the sound. It's, it's pretty quiet. Um, and I just told him, you know what? Instead of getting a new one, you can just have the one off of my car for free. You just gotta take it off, put the stock one back on, and you can have it for you, all free, whatever. Save a little bit of money for other stuff you wanna do to your car and whatnot. Um, so, I was gonna wait for Philip to come and hop into that exhaust video. So Philip's under the car right now. It's just four bolts, um, two connecting to the exhaust hangers and two bolts that connect the exhaust to the mid pipe. So here's the exhaust that's already on Philip's car. It's an active auto works exhaust. I honestly think this exhaust sounds pretty nice. It's just super quiet. It's barely louder than stock. Philip wanted something louder and you know you wanna save a bit of money so you know what? Here we are giving my exhaust to him for free. So we're just gonna take that off, put this ugly stock one back on, make my car super boring again. And uh, so Phillips is under here, it's four bolts, should be fairly simple. However, all my bolts are original. They're all rusted on, they're pretty good. It's gonna be pretty annoying. If you ever taken off an exhaust, you sort of can relate and know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> The bolt spinning in the back. It's the original. It's the original bolt, so you know how that is. Nice, dude. Nice. Yeah, these things won't come off. <laughs> the only problem is I can't get there. It would be a dead one there. It's stuck up his ass. No, it's not, dude. Yeah, it is, dude. Dude, it was a bee. It's right what? there. <laughs> I told you I grabbed something. I pulled it out. Dude, what oh, you did. Fucking bee. You did get Wait, stung dude. by a bee. I got stung by a bee on my ass, dude. <laughs> no, 100%. Ow. Fuck. <laughs> Dirty ass. Hurt you, bro. No, don't kill it more. It's already dead, it's already dude. Dead, dude. There's no stinging. Yeah, it went in my ass! <laughs> <laughs> it did. In the Dremel, you think you can cut this off right here? Yeah. That's what I need to get off. Yeah, on, but it's in the inside though. It's the active auto works exhaust. It's not Imperial. so that this can hang lower uh, so you can get in there but I'm not sure if that's actually gonna work so I still don't have enough like leverage to do anything this way see but you can put the drill in there what drill? the dremel and cut it like in this way? yeah just cut it it's not no the circle doesn't even reach in here though that's the thing What up you guys so it's actually the next day what happened is we got three of those four bolts off the fourth bolt though if you're familiar with the e36 exhaust where the exhaust um, bolts up to the mid pipe it's actually on these uh, collars and they free spin on the exhaust itself so when you get up in there you can kind of turn them manipulate them get your tools sort of in the right position to take off those bolts however mine's rusted shut on there from being so old and on there for so long so we can't really get any tools in there. I told him just to get a Dremel, try to cut it off, but we couldn't, you saw that. We couldn't really get up in there correctly and he couldn't cut it off fully, so that didn't work. So we said, screw it, let's just take it to a shop tomorrow, have them do it, put on a lift, cut it off. So Phillip's car's actually at that shop right now, getting a new head gasket installed. Um, and then after I fixed the suspension on my car because I did it improperly the first time, get that done drive it over and finally have this bolt off as you guys can see when that happens uh, shock just going up and down and through there take this off take this bolt off uh, yep 
replace it with a new one. All right, so here's the old one off. Rip through the rubber bushing. Um, I think it's because I didn't have this washer to stop it, so the had nothing to stop it, so it was just pushing all the way through, and it pushed through the pole up to the top. So the order, now that I know, is the new shock mount. This goes down first, shock mount, then this washer on top. I checked this side to see if I also fuck, fucked up the order. The washer, and I did, I had this on top, and this needs to be underneath so it doesn't shoot through. So we got the left one out. Here it is again, you gotta put this washer on the bottom, and then this washer up top. But this washer prevents the shock from sort of shooting through the top of your car like I had before, where the whole thing shoots through. So there we go. Luckily, this one didn't break like the right side, so I can still use this. Finished. <laughs> now it drives. It won't come out. So these ones are okay. We can we can take this one out. This one is just we gotta cut that bolt out. What are we doing, Phil? Cash money. <laughs> That's what we're doing. It's good. How do things were retarded? <laughs> Where are you going? AutoZone! <laughs> okay, Walmart recently flew out my window, so I can't even... I get store credit now. <laughs> Obviously no store credit. You did get store credit? No, I have to. I have to jump out. Ooh, all set. It's my new mechanic. <laughs> my new mechanic. <laughs> all right, now we can go back and put this dock one on. We can get the exhaust clip, dude, of the whatever this exhaust is. It was on Phillips' car. <laughs> nice, finally. Dude, my car's finally sick, dude. This <laughs> is so small. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, it's so sick. Look at that. Woo. A lot of work for an exhaust. Four more bolts. Get in the last exhaust hanger. Just always the you know the one thing that needs to go in. See, now look at we're actual mechanics. Oh, fuck it. Oh. <laughs> Here, push it up and I'll land it. Oh, it's Oh, man. It barely fits in here, though. Just gotta do it, dude. <laughs> you just gotta get it in there, bro. Do I need to hold this shit? You already got one, right? Just hold it, Will. <laughs> Dude, it's already bolted on there. It's like we're done, except this guy put the bracket on the wrong way. For some reason. Didn't, didn't figure it out before. <laughs> you done? <laughs> 
only took like two days when it should have taken one. Yeah, what do you think it's gonna sound like, Will? Uh, dude, brand new. Rev it, rev it. Sounds way louder on your car than mine. <laughs> right, that's gonna be it, you guys. Phil got my exhaust that I gave him. Gave him a free exhaust. It's pretty much all that's been done to this car actually so far. Exhaust, little things like valve cover, gasket, and random bullshit. New shift, nah. I think that's it. ZCP. Yeah. It's a lot of random shit done. Tint. Oh, now I got some like, seats down. Oh, tint and. And the uh, new kidney grill. We're gonna get the black ones. They didn't do that. Oh, the black ones look bad. So that's pretty much it now with the exhaust, random maintenance stuff. Yeah, the black one looks super right now. <laughs> yeah, well, when he put this, when he bought this one, I was like, wait, why didn't you buy black ones? And then he showed me the photo of the black one. I was like, oh yeah, it looks awful. And then I showed Mark's picture of it. Looks like. All right. Next time, peace out.